Hi, Heidi Kekamisi, and I'm gonna show you today how to create a hyperlink in an email. But first of all, what's a hyperlink? A hyperlink is simply a word or a group of words that you can make live inside of an email and send somebody where you want them to go. It looks a lot better, it's a lot easier for people to use, and it just looks more professional. So let's get right to it. Let's learn how to create a hyperlink in an email. So we're gonna to go to Microsoft Office, which is my email account. We're gonna set up a new email. And first thing you're gonna do is click insert. You'll notice the hyperlink button is gray. It took me a long time and a lot of frustration to figure out how to make that active, but here's the quick tip. You simply click in the body of the email and now it's active. So here we go. We're gonna go ahead and set up the hyperlink. So the first one we're gonna do is to download a document. And this is so much better than just attaching it. So we'll just pick one randomly as an example. And there you go, download document. So I'm gonna send it to myself. I always like to test my hyperlinks before I send them out to somebody. You definitely don't want to send something out that's not working. Now we're going to go do the same thing and we're going to click the body, hit hyperlink, but this time we're going to send somebody to watch a video. So we'll just type watch video and we have to go find the video now. So just search for it like you would pretty much any other thing you're searching for in your documents. Click that, just pick one randomly. There it says watch video. And let me give you a quick tip here because sometimes people just use one word, but remember some, some people will just scroll through your email. They wanna read the whole email before they go back and click the link. And then if it's too hard for them to find the link because it's just one little tiny word, they may not click on it. So make sure you put enough words here as your hyperlink that it's easy for people to scroll back and find. So let's send this to myself again as a test. And last but not least, we're gonna send somebody to a webinar registration page. So set up the same way. We'll go to insert, click on the body, make the hyperlink active. And here we'll say register for webinar here. And I like to click the existing file or web page, paste it and go. And see how it's a little bit longer. It would be really easy for somebody to find that if they were scrolling around within the email. So now I'll send this to myself as a test. And then we're going to check them all, make sure they all worked. So the first one was a download document. Click on it. You're going to get this warning because sometimes hyperlinks aren't trusted. So just click yes. Go ahead and open it. And there's the document. So that one worked. Next, we're going to test the video. You're going to get the same warning. Hi, Heidi Kakamisi. And there's the video. And last, we'll test the register for webinar here. And that takes us straight to the webinar registration page. So all of them worked, which is great. So that's how easy it is to set up hyperlinks. So um, I hope you got value out of learning how to create a hyperlink in an email. And if you got value from this video, make sure you like it below, comment below, and subscribe to my channel.